Well, good morning, everybody. It's Patsy from Patsy Crochet again. Um, I have another questionnaire. Um, it's from the lovely Tori from Polly's Crocheted Creations, Victoria Pat. Her name is Tori. Everybody calls her Tori. Okay. She has these questions, so I thought I'll answer them online, too. The first question she asks is, how old were you when you started crocheting or knitting? Um, I was nine years old um, in one of my foster homes in Brantford, and um, I was watching someone knit. I can't remember who it was, and, and my foster mom was crocheting, so I wanted to try. Now, I have ADHD, so when I, I was doing it, I really liked doing it, but I was trying to do it so fast, right? But anyways, I started when I was nine, and I'm 50 two right now so that's a lot of years so I can't tell you how many years that is so you guys didn't count I hate count <laughs> okay so um number two where where you taught were you taught by someone or are you self-taught I was taught by uh one-on-one -on -one with my foster mom a long time ago um number three what was the first project that you made i made a beautiful granny square blanket the original granny square blanket it had all different colors and i believe back then though oh my heavens it had to be red heart super saver or burnett one of them it was a long time ago so i don't know what yarn it was but i know it, was, it had to be in a line of those kind um number four do you have any allergies to natural fibers yes i can't use wool um i can't use alpaca i can't use anything that is itchy um so wool related alpaca what's the other one anyhow there's I have allergic reactions to them. Um, but if I ever want any of that, I would keep it and try it. And if it didn't work out, I would um, wear those gloves and make blankets for the elders or something like that because I know that keeps them warm and most of them like that stuff. Um, Number five, what is your favorite yarn and do you have a favorite color? Well, that's the same kind of questions uh, from Bagel Day from Crystal. I love so many colors. There's too many colors to pick my favorite. Uh, my p favorite is pastels, but I also have favorites of bright colors too um, and neutral colors. So I'm sorry, I'm in love with all of them. <laughs> that's my favorite. Um, that's a hard question because a lot of people have a lot of things, but if it had to be one Pacific, it would be pastels. Um, what is your favorite, um, or oh, my favorite color would, you see, there's too many. Um, I like baby, the pastel colors. Um, I also like the rainbow colors. Um, so the yarn um, and my favorite color would have to be Pink, light pink, blues, uh, whites. My favorite color is white. Um, but I like generally a lot of colors. Um, sorry, I couldn't answer that one properly because there's too many colors that I like that are my favorite. Um, what is your favorite stitch? It has to be my V stitch. It is beautiful blankets to turn out beautiful blankets uh, shawls um, shirts I'm, I'm want to try uh, one of those sh uh, yarns that I got um, in a V stitch in the shirts so but I have a couple projects that I want to do so I can at least show you what I've been working on um, my hands were out for a long time so I'm just taking my time doing things and I do want to do a tutorial and I do want to do uh, a yarn and hook review. Um, 
how long have you been crocheting or knitting? Like I said, so nine. It's gotta be about 40 something years. Um, what is your favorite thing to cr create? Um, baby things. Um, when I finished the, my first baby sweater, I was really proud of myself. I didn't think I could do it, but I did it. But I did it with one-on-one -on -one with some help. Um, I tried another one. I did a vest for a baby girl next door to me. And she still hasn't worn it yet, but she is just starting to grow. So she will fit into that soon. And I did a nice mauve hat with it, so it looks really nice. Um, and baby blankets, you know. Uh, what is your favorite yarn store where you live? Mine would have to be Michael's. Um, Walmart has some, not like in Fort Erie, Walmart doesn't have that many selections, but the one in Niagara Falls and St. Catharines have a lot of different selections. So, but I still say Michael's. Yeah. Uh, what is your favorite online store? It has to be Lovecrafts. Yeah, Lovecrafts. Um, Okay. Lovecraft, I like the wool warehouse. Um, um, I did cup order two things from um, a lady on YouTube, uh, the yarn nut. Um, two things of the pistachio um, yarns from Ice Yarn. So that was really expensive for two. Um, I got eight balls of rainbow, pistachio, and the gray, pink, and white. So that's coming in soon, so I'm going to show you that. And I also ordered some nice cotton from Good, I think it's Good Loops yarn from, uh, five, is it five o'clock? I don't know. It's another YouTube thing. I will let you know all the details when I get it. <laughs> um, so that was number 10. What was your favorite yarn stores online? Okay, well, I'd like to say thank you, for Tori, uh, uh, from uh, Polly's Crochet Creations. Please, if you guys haven't checked her out, please go to her channel. She's a beautiful lady. Um, I love her. She's really awesome. And another shout out will be going to um, Bagel Day Crochet with crystal she is very good awesome 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 she's got beautiful baby dresses um, I want to try there's a shawl that she just finished doing that I want to try and there's a couple of shirts that I want to try from her too so there's a lot of projects that I have written down that I'll show you that I want to accomplish not in all one day <laughs> and um, I'd like to do another shout out to um, crafty owl with Darla or Darla crafty owl I hope I said that right, Darla. Um, I'm hoping that she hits her 3K soon, or unless she already has. Um, is it 3K? Or 2K? I think it's 3... I think it's just 3K. Not even sure, but everybody check out uh, Crafty Owl with Darla. She, uh, she's really nice, uh, nice lady. Um, another shout out would be going to Sandy Crochet A from Canada. Sandy, hi. And um, Alison Russell, please, from the UK. Please join each of these channels. I don't know how to do the links, but I'm hoping that you guys have already linked up with them. And Gary from Urban Planet. Um, thank you so much for watching. I will be back on. I do want to do a couple more. Um, things online with you guys and um, I love you all stay safe um, I'll be back on shortly with um, I think I'm gonna do a yarn and hook review because Elaine wants to know how Caron Simply Soft works up so I'm gonna do one of them and then I'm gonna do hopefully a tutorial on um, a dishcloth or you can do a hot pad and I hope that you guys join me for that you can do it at home while I'm showing you how to do it on 
my channel tonight. Um, thanks for watching, everybody. God bless you. I love you. Thank you, Tori. Bye, everybody.